Hello everyone, hope you're fine. In this video, I would like to show you how we can install the Datadog agent on a Red Dot server. So the first thing I want to, to do is that I want to show you the three command we want to use. And thanks to the official site of Datadog, the installation of Datadog agent is pretty simple now. So here I have the file I have prepared. So the first command, I want to export the environment variable dd underscore agent underscore major underscore version as the key and the value is seven. And seven here means I want to install the seventh version of the Datadog agent. So the first command I want to type here is export to export the Datadog, the environment variable dd underscore agent underscore major underscore version equals seven. So that's done, the first step. The second step, it's the same. I want to export another or the second variable environment. And now it's the value of the key is, or the key is the dd underscore api underscore key. So here you are. So now I press enter. So the first environment variable has been exported and the second one also. And the last step I want to use bash command and then curl to download the script on the internet and the script called install underscore script point sh. So now I want to press enter. Here you are. And now we am or yum install all the package needed to install the Datadog agent. And the Datadog agent now import the key, API key, and the seven versions of the Datadog agent. Normally it takes about 13 seconds. And now here we are. It's on green, the message is on green. Your agent is running and functioning properly. So now I want to just verify the installation and the running of the Datadog agent. So I want to use the command systemctl status status data system So here we are, as you can see, in the active here, the states or the status of the Datadog agent is active and running. So I want to show you also another thing. If I change or replace status by stop, and now with this command, I can stop the Datadog agent. I can verify if the Datadog was stopped properly status and here we are the activity now is inactive and is dead instead of running so i want to re restart or rerun by using the command start data doc agent and if i use status another also so here we are it's now active and running so as you can see it's pretty simple Thanks for watching, hope you are enjoying and see you in the next lecture.